Hey, good morning, everybody. Welcome to the Word for Today with Reverend Bradford Hole. Today's word is uh, in 2 Corinthians 12, 9. It says, My grace is made sufficient in your weaknesses. And what it really means is all of us have strengths, and all of us have to... Hi, Jesus. Good to see you on the broadcast. All of us have strengths. All of us have weaknesses. Some of us have physical weaknesses. Some of us have emotional or f- spiritual weaknesses. Different, different, different things. You know, some are financially struggling. We all have different weaknesses. But rather than hide those weaknesses, the Apostle Paul said, I rejoice in those weaknesses because when I allow myself to be transparent and ask God to step in and make up the difference, then God gets the glory out of it. I'm thinking of Joni Erickson Tata. She is completely paralyzed from, I believe, the neck down. Yet God has powerfully used her. Hi, Mandy. Good to see you on the broadcast today. Powerfully used her. Um, and, And there are others who have physical handicaps. But they've used what they had for God's purpose and God's glory. So my question to you is, what's keeping you from obeying the Lord and doing what he wants you to do? Is it fear? Is it doubt? Or is it being overly sensitive about a weakness that you have? Humble yourself and and be transparent and let God lift you up. That's the word for today. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Jesus loves you and we do.